Welcome back to the Evolution Pod Club. I'm your host, Jackie Seiden. We are here. We are here for you. We are here behind you. We are here in front of you. We are here next to you. We are with you. We are always with you. Your guides are always with you. You are never alone. You are more loved and supported than you can ever imagine. You are source, as in the source of all that is. You are source, as in source split itself into infinite pieces to go out and learn and discover who source is. Source is love. What does it mean to be love? What does it mean to have total acceptance? Well, in order to know what love is, you must know fear. You must know what fear is. So all the different expressions of source go out into different realities and play around with what it means to feel fear, what it means to not be love, but really what it means to forget your love. What happens if you don't know your love, but rather you think everything around you is happening to you and you're a victim in a crazy and mad world as opposed to the creator of it all. And then what happens as you start to discover who you really are? What happens as you receive the information that you are source, that you are love, while playing around in this reality? What happens when you start noticing the contrast in the form of negative emotions? You created a feeling reality. You're always feeling something. This is your strongest non-physical sense. So as you realize that the fear and darkness is an illusion, you begin to question everything. Why would you create such pain and difficulty and struggle in your everyday life? Why would you let yourself fall in love with someone who's not in love with you? Why would you give yourself cancer? Why would you create physical pain or unwanted circumstances? So that you would test your beliefs. So that you could learn to realize that none of this is real, that this is all part of the illusion so that you could process the fears these people and circumstances ignite in you so that you could see that the only reason you feel fear about any of it is because you're forgetting who you are. The only reason you feel fear is because you are buying into the illusion of it all. The only reason you feel fear is because you have beliefs about yourself that are any, anything other than I am a limitless being of pure positive love and acceptance. Because if you knew who you truly were, if you could remember you would realize in an instant that you created all that contrast so that you would have a way to experience life. You would have a way to take this adventure. You would have a way to learn about what it means to be loved. You would have a reason to create desires. Desires are what drive you. Desires are what gets you here on this journey of self-discovery. All desire is born from lack. It is born out of fear. And yet without your desires to be happy, to be healthy, to be successful, to be in a relationship, to be abundant, to be free, to be whole and complete and worthy, you would not take one step in this journey. Without your desires, you wouldn't care. And without time, you'd have no urgency. So don't you see how perfectly you designed the system? Don't you see how you created all to come and see how much you could learn and expand and grow and evolve? And you're doing so, so fast now. We see you. We see you. We are here with you, smiling, loving you, speaking to you, sending you thoughts in the form of inspiration to guide you on your journey. All you need in order to hear us, or rather interpret us, is to get back into alignment when you don't feel good. And boom, we are there. Arms open wide ready with whatever you need in each and every moment of your entire life until one day we are reunited and you once again know you are love and that you are not separate. You are the all and the all is you. The illusion is that we do need to be reunited. The truth is we are already all united as one. <laughs>